No bother like that. We want to hear no friggin' music from Jamaica radio. Cause when I go to America, America or a Sadka or wait to a name, me don't hear reggae music once a month. And from my radio station, me listening to the American chart. What kind of bumbo cloud thing that? I am tired of that. Reggae music must be respected. Are we the singers and players of reggae music who brought this momentum to Jamaica now? Because if it wasn't for reggae music, all these people would not be standing here. And that's become a sing-along for your encore in your current tour, O Bumba Clot. And yet, most people in this country are unaware what Bumba Clot really is. And we had a lot of calls Sunday at the show to explain, first of all, what Bumba Clot meant, and secondly, why it would be banned. Uh, could you answer those questions for all the people why here? It would be banned. <coughs> well, everything that speaks the truth is banned automatically within the ship still. And Bomba Clot is just another African word with spiritual vibration, with heavy spiritual vibration that the ministers of technology and evil knows. So because they know of the originations or the origins of the word and its power thereof, they are trying to put a ban on it. But it cannot be banned because it is in people's minds and is transmitted from people to people. <clears throat> and as long as it is going around to people, people will know it. But it's not to know the word, it's to know how to use the word for it to have that powerful vibration. So Alright, listen me. And listen me key in the Hype TV people and people in Hype TV land. Listen me carefully. Saying sugar farmers in Jamaica living below the poverty line. Certain people never write about that to the, in a letter to the editor. Chicken back raised, flower raised. Certain people never write to the editor about that. All of the civil servants then were working ridiculous hours to get paid. Some be little bit above the minimum wage uh, in the streets right now, Jamaica. Nobody talk about that in a letter to the editor. So why ramping shop and these Songs, create such a controversy and create such an outrage because these people are targeting dancers. When on the other hand, when a certain famous ambassador was found to be exploiting young boys sexually and, and stuff like that, nobody made a national outrage about it. You know, and I find the double standard within the system. You know what I mean? And it shows so they're basically fighting dancer music and them fighting dancer fans, which is 90% of Jamaica, which is the garrison, poor people, normal people like me and you, you know what I mean? And uh, watch you now, 50 cent to candy shop, you think a candy matter about? Liquor wind or lollipop, and a lollipop you matter about. See? So you have songs like even this girl that do a song, say, I kissed a girl and I like it. So where, where your standards lie then? When you're, when you're gonna ban a Vibes Cartel song, say in Ramping Shop, but you're gonna play a foreign song with a girl singing, I kissed a girl and I like it. You know what I mean? So where the moral standard lie? You know what I mean? So it's things like that to really get Vibes Cartel upset and we decided to just take legal action against the Broadcasting Commission, win, lose or draw. Well, right now, them take a hasty decision without even con confirming and reasoning and keeping a meeting with a lot of industry people, you know what I mean, without, before making such a decision. For example, if you watch TVJ or you watch CVM, which is local stations that people have access to freely, you will find R-rated movies being shown, PG-30 movies being shown. And if you watch the original movie on a cable station, you will see that the movie has a lot of curse words and a lot of sexual explicit scenes. You know what I mean? But when it's shown on TV, JRCVM, it is edited and then it is shown. So, we the double standard lie with a Vibes Cartel song that is edited and played on radio. Bigger than that, you have programs, even, even simple cartoon. In but that show in the day and a lot of these local stations. Even teaching the kids a lot about homosexuality. Boys kissing boys, girls kissing girls, even the PG thirteen movies. You see me? So we are the double standard lie right there. You know what I mean? So it's all about talk to you about Miss Esther. Miss Esther Tyson, Ms. Esther Tyson. <laughs> hallelujah. Cartel, mm. why you door up in the letter? Cartel, why? <laughs> why you do up the woman? No, because And you don't think she did have a little bit of a point? Yes, but 
they always try to step on people that look like they can be stepped on. Example, why didn't the Broadcasting Commission keep a meeting with the key players in the industry and try to come to a compromise on how best to deal with this issue of editing? No, let saying. me explain why. They, they, they just banned every daggering song, every song with beeps in it without keeping a meeting with us because meetings are only kept between people with diplomacy. That means they have dance hall artists as Boto and Dopibat. That's why they did that. Okay. And I mean, and that hurts me. So that's why I'm responding the way I'm responding. And I mean, that's why I wrote my letter. Mm -hmm. They put it out, they published it, but they, they edited it and I was kind of hurt. You know what I mean? But I emailed the unedited <laughs> letter in our email oh blast. So I know all the relevant people got it. So you know what I mean? going to clean up the music? The music can be cleaned up, but as I tell you, it's method, you know. It's how you approach people. You can't approach us like we're nobodies and we're like we're terrorists of society. You have to but approach us in... some people feel like that's the, whole, that's the way all the dancehall artists coming across. Well, you know, they, are, they are in, in for a bit of surprise because the teacher is here. Up close. Meet up, no man. Bad, artists can't meet up, man. The artists them too hype, and man, I worry about who are we this and who are we that. So the people know that also, so they know we divided right down in the middle. You know what I mean? So but, only need for unite. Yeah, well, it's a slow process because you know the mentality of Jamaicans, especially artists. You know what I mean? No, I don't actually. Tell me. All right, they feel <laughs> like them feel like we as artists can unite. They know that because of how the culture system set up. They want to and say, cartel this, and me and cuss and say. Bunty this already. <clears throat> and even us as artists miss the real issues. You know what I mean? That's why people can walk on us as they feel like. What's you know the, real issue? Issue? the real issue is that artists need to unite and without unity we'll always be stepped on. Example, if Vibes Cartel and, and other artists who do the Daggering songs, songs are banned. You have example, some man who do reality songs, quote unquote conscious songs in our corner. See them like, yeah man, the boy them song for band. That means our song will play more harder. But wait till next year when the people them come and say, oh, you know, you can't say weed in song again, or you can't say ja, or you can't say social commentary. Then you step on everybody. And then they might feel the pressure. So it's all good. Artists. I don't know, man. The cycle of yeah, dance. They do research about dance hall. Um, the Carolyn Cooper and a lot of these people have some books. There are a dime a dozen books, if I may say so, who try to dissect dance hall and get into the brain of dance hall performers and the people who are fans of dance hall music. And that is total rubbish. And so far, far um, distance from what is really happening in, 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 in the culture. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So you might be saying here so that you're challenging the I'm findings of the social scientists. Yes, man. Community. Yes. And, and you say you're not a leader. I'm not a leader. But those who are leading. But I'm a person that I would consider you, myself you're well You're challenging enough. their findings. Yes, because I'm reading what they're writing and I'm living the experience in the street with the real people involved. Yes. And there's no, I can't see it. it, it, it they're so far fetched. A lot of these people writing these articles and writing these books about dance hall, they're not even in dance hall. They're not even in the real communities. They're not even around the real proponents of dance hall music. We're going to give you some props for reading the dance hall well, because we know that for a man to be at the top of dance hall, the man who reads the street, the streets mm -hmm. best, mm -hmm. is going to be at the top of dance hall. Do you agree? Yeah, that's that why is I'm your that is your special <laughs> that is your special <laughs> that, that is something we have to give you. Uh, yeah, you man. read you're reading the street very well. Yeah, man. All right. The people um, the system I told me now a monster you. Does it mean? I mean, what's when me start spill my gut? I want hyper. Reaction or come back at me, you know. I tell you about it. Come at me, I get to the now a monster, you know. Then we are there. I mean, I humble you when nothing to bother me, you know. You see me? I feel like right now, I want to be a monster in every way, you know. Then we are there in music right now. I need to like no artists right now, too much of them. I read some, but then corrupt, you know. Then we are there. Everybody want fame and power right now. I mean, guess where I come from? I you used to them thing they like a man just bad mind and just take it here so straight, you know. We live as one where I come from in a dog, isn't it? So I don't use a certain system. When I come and say, so man, a bad mind, man, and tension. I never come in a music for them thing. You know what I mean? I come to earn my royalties for my youth. Them. You know what I mean? I come to music and make sure so my youth them happy and fight. I don't come in a music for this man through maybe more than a dollar. You know what I mean? Show me. No shortage of Tommy Lee singles and videos, but the DJ relying on the internet rather than radio to keep him current. I YouTube my thing there. If I never for YouTube, me and my career that done right now. If I left it to radio. So I had a big up YouTube straight and big up my Viva channel. Cause I drop my thing there. In a no time, I must have my thing there. <laughs>
And I run up, is it? Anybody coming out to the dance floor and get your dance Yeah, party. like how how would the banning of music, like I would know that it would affect the artist, but... Well, even if them banning music on airwaves, you get still, you get even bigger on the road. Mm. So, there's no going around it. Mm-hmm. You know? Can't tell a bad artist. Mm-hmm. You can't go around it. She probably heard about something still, but... <laughs> <laughs> probably really think that just last year she did a quote him lyrics for night. But what could have happened? Like you know, you're no. going like said him a friend. No, I don't no, know. No. I don't think he's not like that. Maybe she'd want him to come out of <laughs> jail for perform for her oh, birthday and it never go on. What? You guys know. are <laughs> extra. <laughs> <laughs> so no, but you said it wouldn't affect you any at all? Like no? No, it's not good. why would Our it affect producers? me? Our producers. No, mm. why it do why would it affect me, car? There's millions of artists out there, mm-hmm. so. But so just not so not even just cartel like, but any song that she deems to be affecting mm, the moral like family, value system. If of you say family, if you get banned, actually get banned. How oh, oh, that would affect you? How oh, it would affect you? It would probably make him bigger too. Mm. Mm, you know, any ban in a song, go and make a song big. Cause they do dagger that. From me did in high school. Mm. The word they allowed for separate ear, don't Sorry. Right? Yeah. Dagger that. Dagga that really, yeah, the babies. With, with, with yeah. Braga. And yeah. the song get banned first week. And, and everybody YouTube big song. that. <laughs> yeah. You know? So. The band that song not going to stop it. Mm. Just going to get bigger. Mm-hmm. Who wants to be heavy?